Good morning, hello there, and welcome. Thank you for tuning in. This is Justin Mott, and now it's time for your local and area news. Well, today is Election Day, and here are your polling locations for Shelby County. One North is the First United Methodist Church in Center on Porter Street. One South is the Church of Christ in Center, located on Hearst Street. One Southeast is the Piney Woods Family Outreach Center, located on Haley Drive in Center. One Southwest is the Center Community House, located on St. Augustine Street in Center. One West is JOI Ranch, located on FM 2026. Polling Location 2 is Excelsior School. Polling Location 3 is Camp Tie Pentecostal Church, located on FM 414. Polling Location 4, Lydia Baptist Church Fellowship Hall, on FM 139 in Shelbyville. 5 is the First United Methodist Church Fellowship Hall on Falkville Road in Joaquin. 6 is Dreka Pentecostal Church Fellowship Hall, located on FM 2427. 7 is the First Baptist Church Fellowship Hall on State Highway 87 South in Shelbyville. 8 is the First Methodist Church, located on George Bowers Drive in Tenahaw. 9 North is the Texas State Bank Annex, located in Timpson. And 9 South is the Timpson School Gym Foyer. Veterans Day is coming up, and the U.S. Forest Service is waiving day use fees for Veterans Day. And speaking of our veterans, yesterday I met with Louis McGinney with the Veterans Cemetery near Keithville, Louisiana. He'd like to inform the public about the cemetery. As Justin said, my name is Louis McGinney, and I'd like to uh, try to make people aware of a facility uh, up in uh, northwest Louisiana around Keithville, northwest Louisiana Veterans Cemetery. Cemetery opened in uh, 2007 approximately 11 years and a few months ago. Uh, it was donated, the property was, by Cattle Parish. It is a state veteran cemetery, uh, but was funded with matching federal dollars. Uh, federal government helps with the cost of all veterans that are interred there. Uh, and stated in their uh, cemetery brochure, it was open to serve the people of Northwest Louisiana, the Southwest Arkansas, uh, and Northeast Texas. It primarily serves veterans in a 75 mile uh, radius, 75 mile radius, but that is not strictly adhered to uh, if they're eligible with their military service. And I'd urge them to please uh, contact the cemetery and see if they could be there. The Timpson Lady Bears volleyball team were victorious yesterday and defeated North Hopkins, and they're going to be advancing to the Class 2A Region 3 tournament. Timpson will play Leon or Cayuga. At 4 p.m. this Friday at the region semifinal round at Lobo Coliseum in Longview. In your rest report this morning in Shelby County, Janice Finley, age 37, at Timpson, theft by check, failure to appear, original charge, forgery, failure to appear, original charge, possession of a controlled substance, violation of probation, original charge, possession of a controlled substance, and violation of probation, original charge, forgery. No new arrests reported from St. Augustine County. And for more news, visit our website at cbc-radio.com. That's cbc-radio.com, keeping you connected wherever you go. Or follow us on Facebook at Center Broadcasting Company on Facebook. This has been Justin Mott encouraging you to go out and be amazing. CBC-radio.com, keeping you connected wherever you go.